I'm Ed Sullivan, and this is Broadway, still the most exciting street in the world, still the street of dreams and the street of miracles, because miracles still happen on Broadway. One just happened out in Hollywood, where Academy Award director Frank Capra just completed his newest movie, a Capra picture that's a miracle of laughter, warmth, and sheer delight called Pocket Full of Miracles. And in this one, Frank Capra has dramatized a tender Damon Runyon story that reaches behind the bright lights of that exciting boulevard down there. So you come along with me, won't you? And walk down Broadway. Treat yourself to a moving glimpse of a pocket full of miracles. Apples, apples, help an old lady buy an apple. <laughs> a nickel, thank you, Mr. Rockefeller, you lousy cheapskate. Apples. Frank Capra's mob is taking over the town. Lock, stock, and barrels of laughter. Junior, start a Brannigan. Sock the weasel. Sure, boss. Sock the weasel? He's my brother. Don't argue. Sock the weasel. Hey, weasel. Yeah, yeah. How's mom? Yeah, she's okay. She's all right. Good. Meet the barons of Broadway and their babes in the funniest plot that ever copped your heart. Meet Dave the Dude. He's got a heart where his heater should be. It's made to order for Glenn Ford. Well, I've been waiting two years for one like that. Come here, you. Mm. Mm. One. One. That doorknob's killing me. Meet Apple Annie. Apples at her basket, gin on her hip, miracles up her sleeve. Betty Davis never gave a greater performance. How about that, eh, Annie? Come on, <laughs> Meet Queenie, a million dollar baby without a penny to her name. It's Hope Lang, and she's covered with stardust. You owe me one thing, Queenie, and I'm going to collect you, hear me? I'm going to put you ain't leaving here with that halo still on your head. <laughs> Meet the Count, who wants to cash in on the social register, delightfully played by Arthur O'Connell. And the most delightful mob that ever muscled its way into your heart. <laughs> 